What's up, Wargamers? Welcome back to World of Wargaming. I'm Isaiah. Today, Bill is in the house, finally, after a long break. A little hiatus. Hadn't seen him in a while. Glad to see his face. And we're going to play a game of Carnivale. We're going to be starting in on one of the short, or one of the, the campaigns from the core book. We're going to be playing the Rashar one, the Prophets of the Old Gods. Starting with the first mission, which is, I want to say, called Lost Prophets. I may have forgotten. But we're looking to, to claim some objectives, which are members of the church that we need to rescue. Before we get into that, though, if you haven't considered hitting that like, subscribe, or bell notification, please consider doing it, as it does help the channel grow. It does help us control the rent and keep all the bad stuff at bay. And let's get into this game of Carnivale. All right, so here we are. We're ready to play a game of Carnivale. We're going to be playing the Disciples of an Old God little campaign from the original book. So we're starting in December of 1793 with the Prophets of Dagon. The sun is setting and the workers on the streets of Venice need to be brought back to the safety of San Conciano. Jealous forces have conspired to separate them, aiming to kidnap the Prophets for interrogation. Bring them home. So we have four objectives here, 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 and there. And holding them at the end of the game will be worth two points each. We each have two agendas, and we have to score both of them to score any of them. So I have decoy, which is have one of my guys in contact with three of his, and scouting the land. So three people above at six inches or higher outside of my deployment zone. You have keep the monster, so kill an enemy with a larger base. And then Bill also has scouting the land. So we're going to get into the initiative role for turn one. I guess we'll go through our list real quick. So I'm playing an Enforcer, two Lesser of Drew, a Lesser Rill, a Radru, a Magi Rashar. But on the Doctor side, we've got Zoologist, Zoologist Hellgator, Rhinosaurus. Uh, Frontier is a Beast Doctor. Beast Doctor, Flying Gorilla Monster. Flying Lion and a lab assistant. And a lab assistant for 100 ducats of dollars. Currently, my Magi has the highest command with four. Bills has the highest of three. So we're gonna looking for fishing for sevens. I got four. So I will have the initiative. My activation, I'm gonna use my two actions for the enforcer and double move him up and over that bridge. So gorilla, gonna try to activate. Gotta make the mind check roll. Don't forget your fake dice. Oh, One right. of them's gotta be the. All right, using the fate of the zoologist. Got a success. Boom. So you're good. All right. I'm going to use a move move right there. Rhino is going to activate. Nope. No aces, so it gets a stun Rhino token. Rhino receives a stun token, moves up its reduced movement. I'm going to activate the Radru, who's going to... Scoot on up the bayou. Number two, taking him to here. I'm actually like under the bridge. I'm not on top of it right there. So just theater of the mind that a little bit for me. Gonna activate the gator. Make the mind check. Good gator to go. Double swimming up to there. Bringing the activation back to me where I'm gonna activate one of my lesser Ugdru. And he's gonna swim, I'm gonna swim. Double swim up because I wanna get near that objective, but I'm just gonna hang out there in the water for now. Beast Doctor. On the double move, so you're gonna head up the board eight, get within three inches of four, it looks like. Bringing it back to me, I'm going to. Thanks for a second. Up to there with the lesser reel. Try to jump the lab assistant across the canal. He makes it cool. with two successes. He makes it just from one edge to the other edge. Yep, like right there. And then second move, just gonna tuck in behind the building. Behind the building. Seems legit. We're gonna bring the other Ugdru up to right there, which does it for my activations. You've still got the lion left, I believe. So lion has to make a mind check to activate. Two aces, you're good. And then he's gonna move, move to right there. And then he's got the last doctor. I'm out, 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 I'm out of my activations. He has one more model than me. I'm just going to move up. Uh, move four. And hang out right there. Okay, that'll take us to round two. Initiative. 
I got one. You got one. Oh, I got two. I have a nine and a seven. I got two, so I have the priority. This might be dumb, but I'm charging at this gator. I'm doing it because I have fear. So I'm gonna have to make that, that gator's gonna have to make a mine. Okay, so fear check for the gator. Uh, two successes, we're good. So attacking him, I'm attacking, I got three dice going in. Difficulty four, two successes. Well, you get a you get a defense roll, so your protection roll. Uh, protection four. And you're looking for sevens. Uh, two successes. Two for successes. Me. On to Bill. I am gonna try to activate. One success, so we're good I'm there. Looking to get Five. to right here. Gonna have to make a climb roll move check. Great. You're good. The lion does successfully climb up to the top of the building. I am going to. Go do something. Go up beside the building and tuck in. Right, rolling the for the gorilla mine test. Passes. Mine. Zoom in twice to right there on that move building. Move mine forcer to right there. I was going to activate. It'll remove its stun counter. That goes away. Mine test. Not Passes. Okay. So I'm going to climb up one, and then I'm going to try to get up this building. Yes. All right, so this doctor gonna try to jump the canal. With a dex of four. He makes it. Should, yeah, he makes it. He needed two Maybe successes. Two right there with the second action. I'm going to swim over. Six. Okay. And climb out to there. So one action to move here, and then one to jump to here. Change plan. Doc's gonna move up to the back side of that building and then climb up beside the lion. Uh, makes it, leaving me with this fellow who is going to charge in on the gator. Attack four on dex four. That is four successes and I'm penetration one on this, so minus one dice. So protection four to protection three. Soak one, take three. So mind test on the gator. Success. Passes. And gonna bite the reel. What's your de uh, dex four, I believe. So dex four. So four successes? Yep. You scoop these out. Protection three. Um, fails. Okay. Winging again. Uh, three successes. Guy who was behind the building will move over an inch we and initiative for round three. I got no successes. He got one success. Lion will activate first. Mine Fails the mind test. So All right, so Lion moving up to make the charge attack. Minus one attack for the uh, yes. being stunned. He has penetration one, and what is expert offense three? So I could reroll three points if need be, um, which I will. Um, Dex four. So yeah, you can't reroll the fate dice. Oh, that can't ever be rerolled. Uh, yes. Two successes. Penetration one. One. So protection three. I get one success. You had two. Mm -hmm. Well, one. Two. Yes. You had two successes. And so I'll take the second action. Swing it again. Two successes. And expert. Yep. Okay, three successes. Three successes. Right, pull them out. Uh, three successes. So Magi, gonna move up to right there on top of that stack of barrels and going to vermin, summon the vermin swarm on the gorilla. I'm gonna spend my one will, difficulty five on the spell, I get five successes with my mind of six, correct? Mind six. So that's going to be five damage. No, it's it's like anything else. Five or it's the target difficulty or over. Nice. Okay, it's so five damage on the gorilla. So five damage to the gorilla. You get a protection roll. Okay, protection. I think. I would assume you get a protection roll. Any uh, penetration? No. Okay, protection three. So it's one, so it takes four. Mind test for the gator. Passes. Okay. Gonna chomp at the reel. Four attacks. 
Which is Dex? Uh, four. No. Three on the reel, I think. Real is Dex. No, Dex four. Oh, so, so three successes. successes. Penetration three. So no okay. damn, no set. I'm going to activate this Ugdru and swing at the gator. He is attack four. Fake dice. Dex, what on the gator? Dex is a four. I'm going to spend his current, his will for an extra dice. Oh, that's a crit. Ooh, okay. So that's ten. Yep, one point of damage for every ace rolled. Did you just light the gator? I might have. That's 10 damage plus 1 because his claws are damage one, so it's 11 damage. He's only got 13 life. He's already taken 3, so... Well, he gets a save. It's, he's, um, you get a protection, and it's penetration 1. So his uh, protection 4 goes to protection 3. Does he do it? Um, He gets 1 success, so he takes 10. Yeah, no, he's down. Yes! Get in there, Ugdru. My remaining action from the Ugdru, because that was a bomb swing, I'm going to swim up my five that way so down the Quick quandary for the crowd. Um, technically, like there's supposed to be an inch of movement between the top of the canal and the water. So can we're going to play it that we can attack. Like If you're at the edge of the thing, you can swing at the thing in the water. Um, and I think that may be right, but if it's wrong, please let us know in the comments and let me know where I can find it in the book thank you they're coming all the way to the edge here and gonna try to club me in the head from the edge of the canal so attack four okay uh, i'm dex that looks like one success yeah. for an two. Audrey, i'm dex four ten two uh fail critical fail all right first second action same as the first that's three successes I got one success, so, so I will take okay. two. I'm going to activate the Radru, and I'm going to grapple, try to grapple the opposed light. combat for the grapple, or opposed attack. I got two. You got one. Okay, so I will the grapple you. Roll. Coming off the building, target number seven. Um, no saves, so it would be three damage, but he fallen into the water, so he only takes I'm one. I'm going to move to attack and jump down on top of him. Sploosh. Yep. All right, so against Dex four right now because he's stunned. Um, I got one success, okay. but it's at pin five. So no, yeah, no protection. So one damage. Right, two. It is to Bill. Rhino taking a mind test. Which it fail? No, fails. Yeah, it's yeah. seven, right? Yep. Yep. Trying failed. to jump as far as he can. <laughs> <laughs> no successes. So he'll just splash into the canal, I suppose. Yeah. Sploosh. Rhino happy. Water bath. Swimming the rest of the way over with his movement to get closer to that so canal. Double bridge. moving like into the water and then into the lion with the lesser Ugdru, who has attack of four. My penetration will. Oh, that's right. So dex four. What's your dex on the line? He's uh, got dex, high dex. Uh, five. Five, but minus one for the dex. stun, so dex four. Um, one success. Pin. pin one. So I still have, I have one die, which is... No. Which fails, so one, two damage, because his weapon has damage one. So this doc gonna move up to the edge with one action, and then we're gonna try to jump to this other building. Spending a bunch of will to do it, getting two successes, two aces. Which will get you down into the water and fall. So we got to make a, a potential save here. So dex roll. You got... Yeah, you're good. You're not going to take any damage there. Sploosh safely into Homage. the water. She's going to move... To here. And then I'm going to try to heal... Oh, wait, no. Sorry. I, those those da damage is on the line. So I'm going to try to do my... Swarm spell thing. is difficulty five. Getting one, two, three, four successes. So four damage coming at you. On to the lion. lion. Yes. All right. So the lion goes from four to eight. And how much does it have? Well, it's, you get a protection roll. Yeah. Protection is going to be uh, two. He's only protection two. Yeah. He's, he's an offensive guy. The lion. Yeah. Okay. So two successes though. So you'll take two.
Mind test for the gorilla. He passes. Flying to right there to take a swing at me. Three attacks. That'll be three successes. Penetration. Uh, pen nut. Okay. So I am protection four on the Oak Drew. Those are your dice. These are mine. Looking for sevens. That's a crit. So that's three successes. That'll chunk all the damage. Alrighty. Enforcer will just stay put. Madman coming around this way. That's going to take us into round four, where we will make a, an initiative check. All right. None to my three. All right, so I'll have the first activation. I'm going to activate here and take my damage from being stunned in the water. If we're doing that wrong, we couldn't find anything where it says aquatic creatures didn't take that. So if we're wrong, let us know. And then I'm gonna try to grapple the lady into the water. Opposed attack roll for the grapple. I got one to his none. Is that a fumble? Um, it is, but not for you. It would be if I had rolled it. So I'm gonna move her to right there mm -hmm. and then try to drown her. Opposed attack roll. I got one. He got one. So so activating the rhino. Going to take a damage from being stunned in the water. Going to make a mind test. Uh, fails. So stay stunned. Stay stunned. And uh, up here. And then... Is it one last movement? So now you would just be at your regular movement. Five inches. Can I get to... Um, no. I cannot, but I will, I will get as far as I can. Okay. I'm going to activate here and try to drown the line. That is opposed attack, and you're minus one for being stunned. And I got three successes. You got one. So two successes. So it's two damage for each one. Try to drown him again. I get two successes. You got two successes. All right, line's going to activate. Take a damage for being stunned. One less attack for being... Going to take a mind test. That's right. To see if he's still stunned. He's good. Okay. And uh, four attacks become three on the... Uh, this one's already went damaged, right? No, they're both damaged at this point. Okay, uh, into, into the... Uh, so two successes. Two successes. Two successes. Uh, pen one is only on the T. That's only on the... Yeah. With the fist, yeah. So, so um, protection four. And I will soak one. Okay. And you had one. Going yeah, again? So I'm good. Three successes. Crit, plus one, three successes. No damage. Okay. Ryan is down to one health. Okay. To me. So we're going to activate here, and we're going to try to drown the line. I got two. Two. I have one. So, so that'll be two damage. That's enough to, to drown him out. And then I will charge the dock burn both of the Radru's will to take him up to attack seven for this. Um, and I get two successes. Okay. Um, Four. Stop. Three successes. He'll take one damage. Gonna disengage here. Gonna burn all of her will two, to do it. Two of her four. Two of her four will. So I got one success. He got three successes, so he can move away. And then being able to get out of the river to there because of the, the, the discredit to your movement for starting in the water. All right, so gonna heal there. So mind six, target number five. Uh, one, two, three, four. So that'll take him back up to full. Perfect. And then I'm gonna do some moving we'll pull about. Pull back eight to right there with my remaining two actions. You've got Madman. You got some stuff there. So what are you going to do doctor going to go for the disengage. And I get to roll some dice. I get no success, so he'll disengage. Okay. I'm going to charge the m monkey. Or I technically, I know he's an eight before anybody chimes in. I know he's an eight, but I'm going to call him a monkey. Uh, Dex four, I'm going to burn his two wheel here. So one, two, three, four, five, six, because it's damage plus one. So you got six coming at you, and it's got stun. What's the um, penetration? No, no, no. pen. All right, so three protection. 
saves one. So you'll take five. Yes, they're both at full health right now. How much life is the enforcer at? Um, 14, no, 13. Gosh, They both have 13, as a matter of fact. I'm going to grapple the rhino onto the enforcer. Uh, yeah, I'm going to attack the enforcer. Okay. Uh, three, so three attacks. And you're stunned. Is that accounting for stunned? Oh no. I, so I'm, I may as well. I, I oh wait. First, you got to make a mind test. Oh, that's right. Um, four. Okay. You're good. All right. So. Oh, yeah, my nice. apologies. We were doing stun wrong. It goes away at the end of the activation, not the beginning. My bad. His three. His three attacks go to two. And I'm dead. It's four. So I got uh, two successes. Two successes. Dex four, yep, dex four. No pen. All right. So I'm protection five. And uh, I'm good. I got two successes. So I will take that second action to eat you onto this side. Okay. Well, that, that, that'll that still lower my attack rate. Yes. But I still think it's worth to get you close. So it's still an opposed attack roll. Yeah, you only have two dice there. Because you're minus one attack right now. Um, I got one. You got one. I have two. Oh, no, I got it's one. It's a seven, ah, yeah. That's right. So that's a fail. That man's just going to scoot back and hide again, I assume. Yeah. Okay. So I'm rolling my command here. Ooh, we got a good roll. I got two. He got two. So we roll again. I got two. Got none. He got none. So I will have the I'm first activate action. here and try to grapple him into I'm the water. Try to grapple. I got two. So that's gonna pull him into the water with me. And then I'm gonna try to drown him. Drowning, opposed attack. I got two successes. Versus my protection. Oh, this is opposed attack. Uh, yeah, uh, I mean one less attack, so two. Yep. Uh, no. One success, so that'll be for me, so that'll be two damage. Doctor back here trying to make a climb. Dex roll. Two successes. Yep, he's up. He's up. Okay. I'm gonna activate here. And I'm going to charge up. Uh, so one. Are you attacking? Yeah. So any penetration? Um, one, minus one. Uh, so protection five goes protection four. And... Nothing, so one damage. And I will try to grapple her. Getting two successes. Opposed uh, attack roll. Getting one success, so that will be able to let me pull her into the water with me. Gonna activate the rhino. Rhino's gonna take a mind test. Can't be stunned twice, but he's good. So this shouldn't be here at this point. That should be gone. Because that would have fallen off at the end of his last activation. Right. So he's at three attacks. Okay. Where do my dice keep going to? I keep clearing the tray because oh, right. you forget to because you're a savage. <laughs> you, you, you got Don't touch the dice. Man. Three attacks. Uh, What's your that'll be two hits. Okay. Pin? Uh, no pin. Okay. But it does have knockback. Okay. Protection five. I'll take one. Two. I'll take Second two. action. Comes at me again. Getting one success. Which I pass... So with flying colors, however, I will still take the knock right onto the objective. I'm going to activate my mage, who is going to move to you here. That I'm about to, I think. Yeah. He's got well, 20 health, so he's... Well, Oh no, I'm not wasting time on that. I'm gonna move to here and summon the swarm on five. Me. Two successes. That's it. Well, you still get a protection roll, buddy. Yeah. Protection three. Okay, so that'll do it. Gonna do some punching. So I've got the line of sight to maintain my one. Okay. Yeah. All right, what's your um... dex four? All right, so four successes. Four successes. Protection four. Um, I block uh, three of them. Two. Nope. Oh, that's right. In the water. You're in the water. Um, so no I'll take time. Damage. No, two more attacks. Three, three actions. Two, three right. actions. We're going to remember this time. So you got two successes. I will take them both. All right. And, and one, one more punchy punch. punch. Uh, three. 
I will take two. Okay. Two, one to climb out, leaving me with two. So that'll get me part of the way up, and then the rest will get me. Um, oh, all right. That's true. Um, that will fail. So he's just stuck on the ground. Madman is going to stay put. To the last round. So we'll do an initiative roll. I got two successes. You got three successes, so you have the first. Do a bunch of punching right here. All right. Uh, four attacks. Dex. Uh, three hits. Uh, three saves. Okay. Let's go. All right. Three, uh, four. Uh, two hits. Two saves. Let's go. That's right. And. Okay, there's a good one. There's three hits. And one save, which will finish him off. Okay. But it took all of your actions to do it, so I'm okay with that. Right. With my activation, I am going to use my climbing tools to automatically get a crit to move him up the building and take my charge action. Four. Getting three successes. Any penetration? Um, penetration... Uh, no penetration, but it's damage two, so technically five successes. Okay, all right, uh, four protection. Takes four. My second action, I'm gonna try to grapple him down. I get three successes. All right, that's a close attack roll. Correct. All right, so I will chuck you. You got one success, I got two, so I can Dex chuck you see avoid some damage, which he avoids all of it because blocks one and then two for falling into water. Test for the Rhino, which it passes. Move moving to right here. Three attacks. Uh, two successes. I am protection three. One success, so I'll take one. I'm gonna move with my lesser Ugdru to here. We'll take our attack of opportunity. Getting three successes. Any pen? Pin one. Pen one and protection. damage plus one. So four successes. Alright, so I have four protection minus one. Three, three successes. successes, so you'll take one. And then I'm gonna try to drown you. He's at, uh, seven. I got three successes to drown you. You got one, so I will drown you for four damage. Which will kill him. Which will take him out. Okay, good so deal. At that point, um, we can pretty much call it here. Um, I'm gonna score this because they don't count for scoring objectives. They can't hold them or contest them. I'm gonna score this one, and I'm gonna score that one because I'm within three inches of it, uh, the thing. And then he will score this one back here. So I will score six off of the victory points. Bill will score two. Did you score your other things. Uh, you have to score both. You have to score both of them, yeah. I didn't score any of mine either, so don't be bad. So that's going to be a Rashar victory. So that'll finish up Prophets of Dagon, which is the first game in the little Rashar, Rashar mini campaign of Disciples of an Old God, which takes place in December of 1793. And more importantly, that'll be a good game and a hearty handshake for my friend Bill. Thanks for coming by, hanging out, playing some Carnival A with me today, man. I appreciate you. And I appreciate all of you at home who came by and hung, around, hung out and played some Carnival A with us today. I hope you have an absolutely amazing rest of your day. And as always, I'd like to say a big, huge, from the bottom of my heart, thank you to our patrons who support us and pledge to us over on Patreon. You guys are the absolute best. If you enjoyed the content you saw here today and that's something that you would like to consider doing to help out the channel go over there check out the link in the description check out the patreon there's a lot of cool stuff over there including access to our discord server talk to me hang out with me talk about our work what we got going on in the hobby um some shout outs all kinds of cool stuff check it out if that's something that you think you would be into and regardless of whether or not you do that i want you to know that i am incredibly grateful that you decided to stop by and spend part of your day with me today, rolling dice and pushing toy soldiers around. I hope you have an amazing rest of your day. And as always, 
May the dice be ever in your favor.